Hi everyone, I'm Andre Young and welcome to the You Evolving Now Life Tip of the Month. The topic for this month is called A Leader's Dream. Now I love dreams because your dream, my dream, our dream is what allows us to wake up every morning and put our feet on the ground and hit the ground running. Our dream gives our life direction. It gives it purpose. It gives it meaning. And having that dream is so valuable. So today, I want to give you a life tip on how to live your dream. And if you don't have a dream, how to do it too. So my dream many years ago was just to be of impact and of service. I was just getting out of a divorce and I was in the biggest transition period and pain period of my life. And I just knew that there was other people out there like me that had nowhere good to go and no one good to do it with. So I created an organization and back then it was called Men Evolving Now. And it evolved into having a women's division and then into you evolving now. But my dream back then was to be of impact and of value related to personal growth, you know, and relationship growth, allowing people to live their best life personally and relationally. Over time, my dream changed and it evolved. And as I decided that I wanted to do this for a living, I wanted it to be my business, my dream became I wanted to be able to support my family based off of the concepts that I developed within my own company. And that was my mission. That was my dream. That's what drove me every day. A little while ago, my dream evolved again. And it really stated that I want to be the best and most recognized and most significant person in the world in the space that I consume. So in the space of enhancing leadership and work-life harmony, I want to be the best in the world in servicing companies, employees, university athletics, and schools. That's my dream. So my life tip for you, if you don't have a dream, the first life tip is just to live right. Not everybody knows what they want to do. Some people are in transition. Some people it's a confidence issue. Some people it's the people around you issue, whatever it is. If you do not have a dream or you simply don't know where you want to be and who you want to be, just live right. Do all of the things that you know you need to do. So you have that job, you have that school, you got that family, you have that relationship, no matter what it is, go to it because you chose to be in it and do everything you're supposed to do and do it the right way with 110% effort. Therefore, when you get your dream and when you're ready to move forward, you haven't burned so many bridges or you haven't been so subpar that it's going to hurt you moving forward. Tip two, if you do not have a dream, I want you to expand your definition of success. Not everybody wants to be an NFL quarterback or the CEO of a company or whatever definition of greatness some people have. So if you don't know what your dream is, how can you be great at all of the roles that you already occupy? So as a person, how can you be better? As a parent, as a partner, as a professional, how can you be better? So when your dream does come to fruition, when you do get that vision that you're already great in all of these other areas that will allow the love and support and confidence so you can achieve your dream. If you do have a dream and you know exactly who you wanna be, where you wanna be, and you're on the road to it, one thing, tip one for you, is to do something about it daily. Do something about it daily. See, a dream without goals is just a wish. And a lot of people wish to be successful. So you have your dream, great. What are your weekly goals to make this a reality, professionally or personally? Now, those weekly goals allow you to have daily action. Now your day is all about achieving those weekly goals and on the way to your dream. 
my second life tip for you if you have a dream, you know your weekly goals, and now you have your daily action, is to allow your dream to evolve. See, back then I told you the different phases of my dream, and that was just my professional dream. So allow your dream to evolve. It's okay. Marry your dream, but not the path you think you need or worse, deserve to get there. Marry your dream. Marry the general of your dream. I wanted to be an impact. Now how I became an impact changed over time. So whatever your dream is, I want you to have your goal, have your weekly goals, have your daily, and allow it to evolve and grow and change so you can still be of value as you move forward. Guys, thank you so much. I hope that this resonated with you. Sharing my dream and hearing it out loud resonates with me. Share your dream with other people. Let them know who you are, where you're going, and you'd be surprised of who supports you and how you sharing that dream with other people will motivate you because you don't want to sound like you didn't achieve it, but it also encourages you as you talk about it to go out and live it. So guys, thank you so much for tuning in. If this resonated with you, you're going to love everything at youevolvingnow.com. And I look forward to being of service and value and impact within your company, your university athletics, and your schools. Guys, thanks so much. I will see you next time and enjoy your evolution.